It's so exciting. I, I've always had such amazing experiences um, on Broadway and with the you know amazing collaborations I've had. So this is yet another you know really exciting time for me. This show was different because this is the first time I've written and directed a show, and I was involved in everything as opposed to just say you know writing the score or just being an actor um, you have a lot more responsibility obviously as the writer and the director and then you know being in the show there's a lot of um, a lot of other responsibilities you have too so I really enjoyed it um, it was it was um, something that I've kind of wanted to do and, and I'm just glad I had a chance to to do it for this one Cole Porter was a really interesting songwriter because not only did he write the lyrics and the music, but he wrote songs that could not only function in the shows for which they were written, but they could be standalone songs. And he had this almost crystal ball quality that could, could last decades and decades after the songs were written. On very rare occasions, he uses words that were very specific to the time, but most times the, 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 the lyrics that he writes and the melodies that he writes kind of transcend time. So, you know, when I'm singing these songs to an audience, they're understanding them just like they were written yesterday. I think audiences can expect something that they've never seen from me before. I mean, there are elements of, uh, of concert performance that, that I've always done that are in this show, but it's highly theatrical and, and there are big uh, production numbers and you know, big sets and amazing lighting and um, choreography and, and it's, it's not a, a traditional Broadway show in that it doesn't really have uh, a plot, but the songs themselves are sort of driving the narrative, not in the way a jukebox musical would do it, um, but they're just sort of these vignettes that Cole Porter has written so beautifully, they, they lend themselves very well to, to theatrical interpretation. So it's multimedia, it's, it's, it's different than anything anybody's seen me do before. There are a lot of things in this show that I'm excited for people to say, but I don't want to tell anybody until they come to see it because there's some big surprises. But one thing I can say is that there's about 24 musicians on stage, which uh, is, is, an, is an incredible thrill. I mean, anybody who knows theater knows what it's like to hear live music. Unfortunately, sometimes the the orchestras are, are, are getting smaller and smaller for budgetary reasons or because of advancing technology, but in, in our case, we actually have all of these musicians on stage playing and it is, it is so thrilling. I mean, for me to go out there every night and to be able to play and sing uh, with these men and women is, is, is just an incredible thrill. Three words to describe the show. I'd have to say amazing Cole Porter, because Cole Porter is the reason that the show exists and I think all credit goes to him. If people like the show, I'll feel great because I did everything in, that you can do. I wrote it and directed it and did the orchestrations and I'm in it. If they don't like it, I'm completely to blame. But one thing that remains a constant is that these Cole Porter songs are just out of this world.